What's going on, family? I'm Scrapbook Boxing, Museum of the Forgotten Fisticuff series. The reason why I have these pictures covered up, I'm going to be coming out with a book in scrapbook form, and it's going to have a lot of rare pictures in there. And as a matter of fact, this book here, All Black Fighters, over a thousand pages, 2,000 front and back. Within the two books is 4,000 pages front and back of rare pictures of black fighters. I just wanted to show you this picture here with Harry Wills. He's to your right. He's signing with Charlie Renoff. Now, this man here with the cigar in his mouth, his name is Jimmy DeForce. Now, Jimmy DeForce was one of the most underrated trainers. He was a manager as well. But he had them all. He was an outstanding trainer. I mean, he's very underrated. And as you can see here, Jimmy DeForest, I have all his books. He came out with these books, training books. I don't know, it was four or five of them. I have them all. But, um, man, he, he was something else. You're talking Jack Dempsey and Mickey Walker and Harry Grab. I mean, so many fighters. He tried to get Kid Norfolk. Kid Norfolk was uh, under contract at the time. Here you have Theodore Tiger Flowers. Theodore Tiger Flowers is a light heavyweight at this point, and he tried to uh, fight Mike Mateague. He was the first black middleweight champion in boxing history. He defeated Harry Grab in 1926. And I just have sporadic pictures all throughout uh, these books of black fighters. Here, once again, Harry Wills. And Louis Angel Firpo. And Harry Wills wind up, when he retired, becoming a very rich man. He owned a lot of apartments in Harlem, New York. You would find him in Grubb's Gym on 116th Street. And Grubb's Gym had all the black fighters there. The retired fighters. Fighters who were still fighting and fighters who hung up the gloves. Kid Norfolk. You had... Uh, Harry Wills, Jack Johnson would show up there. Harry Smith, he was a Harlem Thunderbolt. Jack McVeigh, the pride of Harlem. You had them all there. And just wanted to show you, Joe Walcott, his name was the Barbados Demon. So I just wanted to show you uh, this book. And so look out for that book that's going to be coming out shortly. And it's going to have a lot of rare pictures of black fighters in scrapbook form. I'm Scrapbook Boxing Museum of the Forgotten Fistic of Series. All great fights, all great fighters will never be forgotten on my channel. Thanks for watching. Peace.